Hey everybody, I'm Mike Spectre Comics and I'm back. This time I want to say happy 4th of July to everyone here. And a way for me to do this episode, I'm going to be showing off some comics that are inspired, you know, by the word America, whether it's a character, whether it's the name of a title, whether it's just cover art that represents uh, America. So uh, I'm going to start off by putting on my shades to celebrate. And if you want to see what books I have for 4th of July, stay tuned for that intro. Alright, so I'm back. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so you get my content when I put it out there in a timely fashion. If you haven't seen my video that I put out yesterday, check it out. Beers and Comics is back. It's fun unboxing that. Check out the video, what beers I got, and what comics I showed. So uh, we're back. It's 4th of July. Hopefully everyone has a great 4th, has a good weekend. I don't know about you guys, but here in New England, it's been pouring the last few days. And it's actually lightened up a little bit today, so maybe we can have a little bit of decent weather for the holiday. So... I'm going to show you, like I mentioned, some of my, you know, holiday related covers, name titles, characters, and so forth that reminds me of 4th of July. So let's get into it. Change this up a little bit. There we go. If you guys like my shades. <laughs> All right. So first book. Wanted to start off with some DC. Picked this up at a flea market recently with my buddy Rayman. This is DC Comics Bombshells, issue number one. Great cover. Have three of the best female characters in DC. Like I said, three of my favorite characters from DC. We've got this nice, looks like an old school World War II type themed cover with the planes in the background and they're just majestically flying there. I think this is great. Great cover. Speaking of America, a little bit of uh, America Chavez. This is America, issue number two. Just love this cover. You got the uh, tray there with the colors that says America. You got the graffiti in the background. So you got the really cool hat and outfit. Love this cover. Pick this up. Pick this up as well at that same flea market. All right. Going into the uh, DC Vertigo imprint, we got United States versus Murder Inc. Number one, which is written by uh, by Michael Bendis. Just love this cover. It has the uh, some of the great symbolism there. It's a great read. If you haven't read this, check this out. Going into Marvel, this is some Bronze Age goodness. This is actually part of uh, one of the books I got from Rayman from the AOK. And this is Sergeant Fury and his Holland Commandos, issue number 136. You gotta have a little bit of uh, war action in here, because 4th of July, we fought for independence. So, uh, love this cover. Whenever you see these nice little action uh Military covers from the Bronze Age. Pick them up. They're just great cover art. All right. Going into a little bit of indies. Got to put out some image here. And uh, this has been a good read. This came out, I want to say, last year. And this is Undiscovered Country. Just love this cover. I love how you see the, the uh, country of the United States just blanked out there. Because in the story... It's a mystery. It's tough to get into the country, you know, in this post-apocalyptic world. If you haven't read this by uh, Zack Snyder, Carl Soule artwork, and uh, Kamakoli, great, great read. Can't wait to see where they go with this. I think they're like nine or ten issues in right now at this point. But I'll uh, pick this up. Good read. Down to the last two books. This is another. This is from Boom Studios. Has a little bit of spec. I don't know. We'll see if uh, the movie actually comes out. 
but this is Last Sons of America, written by Philip Kennedy Johnson. Great story. I believe it's a four-part series. Yeah, four-part series. Uh, check it out. It's a nice read. And uh, Last Sons of America. And the last book, of course, we had to go back to Marvel with one of my favorite characters. This is Captain America. And this is Avengers number four. Uh, this is obviously the reprint, not the actual copy. But uh, it reprints Avengers number four, which is the first Silver Age appearance of Captain America. You just got to love this cover. Classic cover. You got Namor there popping up in the background on the top. And you got some of your Avengers. So uh, that's it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I want to say again, happy 4th of July to everyone out there that's celebrating the holiday. And uh, until next time, Mark Spectre Comics, out.